Good evening. Today, I'm going to show you guys how to install the Moodle mobile app and some of its basic features. Please make sure that you're connected to the internet by Wi-Fi or internet data throughout the process. To begin with, go to the Google Play Store. Search for the Moodle mobile app. Tap on the app, then tap on install, tap on accept and let the installation finish. Now go back to your menu and start the Moodle app by tapping on the Moodle logo in the menu. Again, make sure you have internet connection on your mobile. On a successful launch, you will be asked for a website URL. This is the URL of the website where your courses are offered. For this demonstration, it is www.iitv.com. Now, submit that. Next, it will ask for username and password. To get this username and password, you need to separately register on the URL you just typed in. So in my case, I will have to go to iitv.com and then register there. I will then use the same username and password here. Once you're done registering on the website, fill in your information and tap login. Now we are on the home page. Here you can see all the courses you are enrolled in. For example, I am enrolled in an environmental sciences course which you can see on my screen. It is in this area that you can see various other courses you are provided and choose the one you want to study. If you are a new user, there will be no courses here. If you enroll yourself on a new course and it doesn't appear in the list, you can pull the list down and refresh the page. This allows the app to update any information on the screen and shows you the latest data. Say you are unable to see or read the text properly on the screen. Maybe it's the size of your screen or that the image is simply too big to fit on your phone. Moodle has an adaptive user interface. This means that if you want to hold your screen differently, the app itself will adapt to your phone's current position, giving you a better and easier way of reading what's on screen. To test this, make sure you have screen rotation on. Then, simply turn your phone into landscape mode. If you have a different device, such as a tablet, the app will adjust to its biggest size thanks to responsive user design and provide the most comfortable layout of images and text depending upon the screen size, resolution, and orientation of your screen. Thank you for listening, and I hope this video helped. In the next video, we'll be covering some more features of the Moodle mobile app.